This Huawei Mate Book 13 good or garbage? Huawei is selling this laptop in two variations, an entry-level version and a high-end version. Both models have the same 13-inch, 2560 by 1440 220 pixels per inch, touchscreen, 8GB of LPDDR3 memory, and a fingerprint reader embedded in the power button. Alternatively, the more accessible model includes an Intel Core i5 processor with integrated graphics and 256GB of solid-state storage, SSD, for $999, about £785, dollars to begin. Another option features an Intel Core i7 processor and NVIDIA MX150 discrete graphics chip, as well as a 512GB SSD for $1,299, about £1,020, dollars Both models come with a useful USB-C dock as well as one free year of Microsoft Office 365 Personal. All it really boils down to is how the MateBook 13 part configurations compare, offering the same or more power over either option for less. For instance, neither the XPS 13 nor MacBook Air offer discrete graphics. Although the NVIDIA MX150 might be low-powered, it gives the MateBook 13 a clear advantage over both options when it comes to video rendering and gaming. The laptop features the same stylish aluminum body as before in either space gray or mystic silver. Open the laptop, however, and you'll notice one key change, the webcam has moved. In addition to the webcam hidden beneath the keyboard in the X-Pro, Huawei has done this MateBook right with a camera resting above the display. That said, it features just a 0.9 megapixel camera at 720p resolution, so you would not be able to look your best online. As thin as 0.59 inches, 14.9 millimeters, and weighing only 2.87 pounds, 1.3 kilograms, Huawei's Mate Book 13 is actually slightly heavier and thinner than Apple's MacBook Air. Not bad for a laptop that contains a full-fat Intel mobile processor and a dedicated graphics chip. Additionally, the keyboard and touchpad on offer here are equally impressive, with plenty of key travel at 1.2mm and the punchy, forceful feedback we require in order to type quickly. The wide and spacious Microsoft Precision Touchpad is also a joy to use, though it leaves much to be desired in terms of a smooth glass finish. If you like the touchscreen on the X-Pro, you'll love it all over again on the MateBook 13. Though a touch smaller, it still puts out 1440p pictures at 100% of sRGB color gamut, and its touch digitizer is just as snappy as ever. In fact, Huawei's thermal work is largely responsible for its performance advantages over previous Huawei and Dell models, considering that both models were tested using the same processor. A processor with more headroom will perform better up to a point, after all. Huawei claims up to 9.6 hours of local 1080p video playback from the MateBook 13, but that's all the company offers. Luckily for Huawei, our 1080p video playback test reported an impressively close 8 hours and 18 minutes, which narrowly outlasted a Dell XPS 13 with a 4K display. While the MacBook Air remains the most powerful laptop in terms of battery life, the MateBook 13 has enough juice to last on most trips without having to recharge, and that's what matters most. In spite of this, we have recorded a PC Mark 8 battery test result that's well below Huawei's claim and well below the average for a laptop of this class. This could be due to a variety of factors, including a sizable reduction in battery capacity versus the MateBook X Pro coupled with graphics that run at a higher frequency than the MateBook X Pro and competitors. Ultimately, we are confident that the MateBook 13 can be used for several hours on a single charge in either scenario. Add to this the USB-C fast charging function, which can provide 2.5 hours of use in 15 minutes, and you have yourself an excellent laptop for frequent travelers. Huawei's machines are generally minimalistic about bloatware, and the MateBook 13 is no exception. This laptop comes with just one additional app, Huawei PC Manager. This app scans your computer's hardware for any issues or missing driver updates that Windows 10 misses, and it allows you to update them with a single button click. Aside from the software, the only important physical feature to note is the fingerprint reader. Integrated into the laptop's power button, this is an extremely quick and convenient way to log in using your fingerprint using Windows Hello. You won't need to wait for more than a second after starting up your laptop to find yourself in front of the Windows 10 desktop. The MateBook 13 is an ideal laptop for people looking for a machine that can perform a little bit of everything. It offers the flash of flagship laptops combined with the performance of gaming laptops. The Lenovo MateBook 13 is one of the best laptops available for people who travel frequently, whether for business or pleasure. Weighing 2.87 pounds and measuring almost half an inch thin, the MateBook 13 is a laptop that will barely be felt in your backpack while providing ample power.